Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Birch. Um, I have really exciting news. I have decided to do a new series um, called uh, Recipes So Easy My Sister Can Do Them. My sister uh, has been begging me to send her videos of me doing super simple family-friendly weeknight meals. And um, so tonight we're gonna start with something that I do best, which is soup. So tonight we're going to do a pantry challenge chicken noodle soup. And for that, the secret ingredient is canned chicken. So let's get started. Oh, and one more thing, um, sorry that this is wiggly. Uh, one more thing, uh, this is also going to be a part of the uh, Three Rivers Challenge that I do every January, the beginning of every year. At least I try to. Um, and that is put on by Jessica at Three Rivers Homestead. I will tag it down below and hashtag or do whatever I'm supposed to do so you guys can find other videos. And yeah, let's get started. Okay, so here we are. We got our chopped veggies. We have our sofrito or mirepoix. We got onion, celery, and carrot. We're also gonna put some garlic in, some salt and pepper, and then some seasonings. So let's get that started. Put in a little bit of oil. And then we're going to start dropping in our onion. carrots, and our celery. And what we're going to do is we're going to sprinkle a little bit of salt on them to help bring out that moisture, and a little bit of this white pepper. You can use black pepper if you want. All right, and we're going to saute this up for a little bit until they start getting soft. And then from there, we're gonna add some more seasoning and go on from there. Be back in a second. Okay, um, we got these wilting nicely. From here, we're going to add some of my favorite jarred garlic. Cause who's got time to cut all that garlic, right? I'm just gonna eyeball it. Then I'm going to add a little bit of smoked paprika. I'm going to do a little bit of celery seed. Ooh, that's a lot. See, that's why you put it in your hand. A little bit of oregano. some parsley. Feel free to zhuzh these up any way you want. I'm trying to keep it simple for my sister. All right, so we got these melting down now. And <clears throat> what we're gonna do is I don't have any, the, the uh, recipe calls for 10 cups of chicken broth. Sorry, 10 cups of chicken broth, but I do not have chicken broth on me, surprisingly. I do not have any broth with me right now. Oh, you know what I forgot? I forgot the fresh thyme. Um, you can use dry thyme. I just happen to have fresh available to me from my garden. Okay, so back to what I was saying. Uh, I do not have any chicken stock at this time, and that's okay because we have something called chicken bouillon. And it says about one teaspoon to every cup of water, but I'm just gonna kinda eyeball it and I don't know. We're gonna saute that into it. And then from there, we're gonna add our water. So get that all up in there. Oh, it's already smelling so good. You can smell that thyme really well. All right, so we got about 10 cups of water here. And we're gonna bring this up to a boil. And then when it comes to a boil, we're gonna add our 
Noodles, I didn't have any wide noodles, so I'm using uh, some elbow macaroni that I happen to have in the pantry. Um, so we're gonna wait till this comes to a boil and then we'll be right back. All right, as you can see, we have got that water boiling. And now we're gonna get the needles. We're gonna put about like a cup or so. Quanto basto. Just as much, as much as you want. But make sure that it's not too much that it's gonna suck up all that moisture. So now we're going to boil this until the noodles are done. And then we will add our chicken. And then at that point, we're pretty much done. Oh, off to the side here, right here, I do have some potatoes that needed to be used. I have those boiling up. I am going to make mashed potatoes uh, that we can ladle the soup over to just make it a little extra hearty. So there we go. All right, we have, our noodles are nice and cooked. I just tried one. They're all nice and cooked. And now all we gotta do is we have three cans. I have chunk chicken in water and we're just gonna pour it in, water and all. One, two, three. Oh yeah, and I also added a bay leaf to the stock, so that too. So now we're just gonna heat this up, heat this through. So every it's basically done now. So we're just gonna heat it through and then we're gonna set it off to the side while I make these mashed potatoes when they're done. Okay. Okay, uh, that soup is done. So I put it off to the side and now we have those potatoes and we're gonna be making some mashed potatoes with these. Um, I put them, I drained some of the potato liquid cause I'm not gonna be using any milk uh, just cause this is a base and I don't know. Uh, I, I didn't have any milk, but we are gonna put a bunch of Kerrygold butter into this. We're gonna mix that all around. We're gonna get it all nice and melted and we're gonna keep adding butter and a little bit of stock or potato starch, I guess, until we get the right consistency that we're looking for. Let me find my mash here. We are going to start mashing. I like leaving the skins on my potatoes. They have minerals and vitamins and stuff like that. I do peel off like any spots or sprouts or anything like that that is showing through. Um, but yeah, let me get these mashed up and I'll be right back. All right, we got these potatoes done. Now all we gotta do is dish up. And there we have it. Our pantry chicken noodle soup over potatoes. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe and all that stuff. But uh, here we go. Enjoy.